I'm having trouble finding um, information on treatment for hormones and stuff. Um, can you elaborate on the treatment for those issues? First, you'd have to get your blood work done to see if there's any hormone imbalances. Sometimes this can be done through your family doctor. Sometimes you may need a referral to uh, a specialist of some kind. Um, many, many physicians aren't um, up on the latest concussion research. And so you might ask them to get your hormones checked and they might immediately kind of discredit you and say, you don't need to get your hormones checked. Why would you need your hormones checked? Um, Basically what you're looking for, the ones that have been implicated are, are pituitary function hormones, things like growth hormone, thyroid stimulating hormone, uh, adrenocorticotropic hormone, growth hormone, testosterone, estrogen, those types of hormones. So pituitary function test is um, kind of what you're looking for is to look at the levels of those hormones and they can fluctuate throughout menstrual cycles. They can fluctuate day to day. So it's tough to get kind of a uh, a good read on them. Um, this is not my specialty by any means. I typically will refer out for this. Uh, there's people that specialize in this now. So there's a, there's a clinic in Burlington, for example, uh, which I'm, I'm just outside of Toronto. So there's a clinic in Burlington now that, that does a lot of this type of stuff. So it's really trying to see what's in your area, trying to uh, get your hormone levels checked through blood work by, by your physician. Um, and then a lot of it is is just replacement therapies. So if you have low, if you have certain low hormone levels, then you would you would take um, different supplements to to boost those hormones. But first is finding out where the issues lie.